I think that um, there are different types of negotiation. I think that um, what is very, very important is to have all the parties recognize each of the, the parties as um, an important stakeholder. Uh, I, I think that if you think about um, the, the process between Palestinians and Israelis, I think that probably each side feels that their own concerns are not acknowledged enough by the other side. Um, whether you are Palestinian or Israeli, you live the situation from a very different perspective. And I would always argue that it's very, very important to know how is the situation in the other side's territory, for example. Is that they should also look at that not simply from the perspective of those who are generally at the table, most often uh, male leaders. I think a lot of, um, maybe we should have many more women involved in, in the peace process. So having more, applying some of the principles of the UN and the thir resolution 1325, having more women involved in the pre peace process probably would be important. Religious people and leaders in particular should really think about how their systems of belief could serve peace more than war. I think that too many people die invoking the, the name of God. Uh, you have Shiites and Sunnis killing each other. You have uh, maybe Jews and, and Muslims killing each other. You have, or it looks like God is often used as a, as a tool um, against the other side, whereas it could be what religion is, which is, it comes from the, the root in Latin religere. Normally religion should be linking people and not, not putting people against each other. So I would, I would really su suggest that people who are strong believers and, and, and religious leaders uh, see the power of religion to help people relate to each other rather than um, fight each other.